notice that my current drive is the C drive. My data disks are located on my USB drive, which in this particular computer has a drive designator of D. So I can reference that D drive by using the DIR command and the D colon. You'll see that my three directories, disk 1, disk 2, and disk 3, are on the D drive. Now if I want to look in the disk 1 directory, I can type in the DIR command, but I can't just type in disk 1 because the disk 1 directory does not exist in my current drive. So I'll want to reference the D drive and the disk1 directory name and you can see that then I can see the contents of the D drive. I'm going to clear the screen. I only cleared the screen so it would look a little bit better on the video. Another alternative is I can change to the D drive by typing in the D colon and hitting the enter key. Now my current drive is the D drive. If I do a DIR command, it shows that on this current drive are the disk 1, disk 2, and disk 3 directories. Now I can change to the disk 1 directory with the CD command, and you see that I did change directories. And again, now I can simply type in the DIR command to see the contents of that directory. Again, what I could not do from the C drive, remember I'm back to my C drive now. I can't change to the disk 1 directory because it is not on this drive. I need to change drives, then change directories.